Hey YouTube, Darren here. Welcome to Mayhem Country Living. Of the seven million channels, you picked ours. I know you got limited time, so thank you for doing that. Did you know that I have posted 1,400 videos in my YouTube career? Ha, <laughs> career. How about that? That's absolutely crazy. 1,400 videos. Something. Anyway, guys, we're going to go out here and cut down some of these trees. These are the ones that are on top of the uh, uh, semi-trailer that's partially buried. That's going to be something we're going to do. I'm going to bring you along, mainly as a witness in case I die for insurance purposes. Uh, what I'm going to do is get up there and cut them down uh, halfway, cut all four of them down, let them drop, and then I'm going to get down cut them on the ground. And I got the chainsaw cleaned up, ready to go. I had to go get some bar oil. There is actually a difference in bar oil and regular 30 weight oil. I've tried it. Uh, regular weight oil does not work very well in my automatic oiler on my chainsaw. How about that? It's crazy. Uh, so I actually buy the uh, bar oil and it does perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay More guys, kind of these are the four offending trees that we are cutting down. Now that first one, uh, the one on the far left here, looks straight enough and tall enough that it might be good to make a uh, side rail for my new bridge that I am building. That looks pretty good. I need 15 feet uh, and that's pretty good size. That might work out very well. Um, now the others are going to go away. So that's all we can do with them. And we have no offending uh, power lines or anything like that. Some of these are uh, surveillance cameras. They're tucked away enough, uh, those, to where they're not going to cause a problem. Those go back in the building. And uh, so we're not going to tear up the camera system or anything like that. So let's go tear something okay, up. Okay, guys, now okay. we're back. I want to show you something. That tree, and this is a great uh, video to do this, that tree is tipped back. I cut it to lean forward, but it didn't quite cut or take the cut, or I didn't do it as well as I should have. Now, and then I back cut it, and it leaned back a little further. Well, what I have is this rope here, and I've got this piece of wood. I ran it through it. I left it kind of uh, with a little bit of flex so I could loop. Uh, a knot and put that piece of wood through it one end longer put a loop on the end of that and what this is is actually a gearbox so we're going to pull this thing over here manually with no electrical power this is something you might want to use uh, if there is ever a problem and you don't have enough fuel or uh, a come along I've got five come alongs and, and, and hauls and hoists and all that stuff but I thought while we're here and it did it let's do this because this is a great idea and we're just going to twist this up it's going to make a big knot this is going to be our gearbox it's going to be really really slow uh, because uh, we're going to be moving it in three quarters of an inch maybe at a time so just uh I'll try to set us up. I don't have my tripod with me right now, but I'll try to set us up. More to come. There we go. So I'm hoping you can see how we're doing it. 
you got to be careful and you got to use a good piece of wood because if it's rotten or anything in there while you're winching it it will crack and whop you in the head so more to come guys so there you go what I did was I just tightened it up as much as I could and I went up there with a chainsaw and made one more little pass and it teetered over and then I went ahead and cut the other one down uh, and that left me with this log right here which is going to be fantastic for making my bridge uh, we needed that right there we needed that bad and I might be able to uh, no that's tapering out pretty good I can use this as some supports that's probably what I'll do and the rest of them are going to be uh, just supports of trash so how about that using a rope and a bar to uh, twist it up good if I needed to what I could have done also is just anywhere along this line that I needed to make a good anchor tie a piece of rope to that and mind you it will affect where it's going to fall I could have pulled it to that tree and brought it down that way too but you know why make it harder than uh, then you have to but I thought that was a pretty good video just using the uh, 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 the bar uh, what did Archimedes say give me a lever and a firm place to stand and I will move the world there you go it's gonna be about it for this video guys thanks for watching thanks for subscribing I gotta start lemon now anyway you just a second you're gonna see a picture of my ugly mug pop up on that side as well as my beautiful wife on the opposite side will be some videos if we are indeed your brand of wacky. Take care of your people. Take care of your people. Take care of yourself too.